All right. Um, you know, we spent a lot of the middle of the video um, looking for someone to marry our daughters. But I guess I cut that out, so you probably didn't notice that. But it took me like five minutes or ten minutes. <laughs> uh, okay, Galata. Oh, what are you doing? Oh, we got another bunch of raiders. Man, screw you. Where's this army? Okay, I did, these are all horse arches again, I guess. Oh, maybe we can... Uh, yeah, there we go. <laughs> That's useful. We can just teleport these troops from England. That's actually very useful. Let's say, uh... Count of Olya. All right. Yeah. Uh, yeah, sure. We can grab that. Hello, girl. Want to give me uh, that old county? Sure you do. Let me accept. Great. Uh, yep. Uh, Asep, Makat, and Raoul. Why don't you guys attack this stupid horde? Uh, Ismailit, uh, Harem of England has been viciously slandering me. Ah, okay. Expose and denounce him publicly, giving me a reason to rest him. Yep, definitely. We're definitely gonna give you... All ingredients are destroyed. Famous laboratory will be removed. If they ever found out we broke into my laboratory, I will kill that vile crook. I woke up last night as the holes keep shook me violent, shook violently. It seems like someone entered my laboratory and set off an explosion. Luckily, no lives were harmed and my laboratory is in ruins. There's nothing to save. Curse us. Man. Man. That sucks. That sucks, my man. But... On the bright side, first off, we're gonna kill uh, kill off this uh, this horde before we forget. And uh, a nice bonus is that <laughs> this will lose the King of England some troops, not that many, but uh, a few. All right, uh, yep, uh, disband. Um, on the bright side, oh, is he now just gone? <sighs> Fucking hell! Really? Seriously? You fucking kidding me? Yeah, 19th of April. <laughs> uh, okay, well. <laughs> oh, he's um, he's imprisoned. Imprisoned by King Anton the Just. All right. Well, that uh, that sucks a little bit. <laughs> we cannot uh, we cannot imprison him. I guess we can uh, we can spy on him. You still have intrigue focus, right? Why not? All right. Um. Uh, yeah, we were. Uh, we were plotting to kill this guy, indeed. Unless he's no longer the uh, heir to the kingdom of Lotharingia. Let's see. If he's still the heir, Baldarich Wichirichir. Oh wait, he is. Ah, okay. All right. All right. All right. Then I got someone more important to kill. And then I hope that he is, his kid will actually remain the heir. We're gonna we're gonna try to antagonize him a little bit. Yeah, okay, this this is his young son. So really, if we can kill him now, then we can press a claim. That would be great. We can just give the claim in like this county, and then we can attack the HRE again. Russian, ambitious Serbian, sure. Need a good spy master. I'm gonna put him in the court as well. The uh, Lotharingian court. Hi, bud. Welcome. You wanna join our court? You wanna help to uh, increase the plot power here in uh, in Brabant? Sure you do. 63%. I think that should tick up a little bit still. Ah, general opinion minus 10. Oh, uh, damn. Hopefully that helps. No. <laughs> okay, well... <laughs> We can still antagonize him and maybe switch to Marshall, and then we have a gun, right? Oh, okay. <laughs> I guess uh, even with the gun, we're still pretty terrible at fighting. <laughs> oh well. Uh, Ribald recently turned down another duel he was challenged to. Uh, at first I was embarrassed on behalf of all the subjects. But who am I to say? I would not react the same way. Well, indeed. <laughs> Perhaps there is value in choosing your battles. Yes, one can never be too careful. Uh, no, I'm craven. 
I would be a Graven guy. You know, I, I haven't fought much in my life. I am cynical, or not really cynical, but I'm happy to have other people do uh, my dirty work for me. What can I possibly do to endear Mayor Popo to me? Uh, he is cruel, right? So we can do uh, isn't there Bart mocking him? Or we can teach him how to deal with his enemies. I think we will do that, because I think we're both cruel. We can teach him some tricks, hopefully. Persons have risen up in Nayera, Nahera. Uh, okay, are they big? Less traders. Ah, okay, like that a bit. Not too much, but he was fine. Yeah, he, uh, he, uh, he didn't mind it. He didn't mind it so much. Alright, we're gonna kill these, uh, kick these peasants' ass. Kick these peasants' ass. What are you doing, man? What do you, what do you think you're doing here? Over in uh, Nahi Nahira. You're not allowed to uh, revolt. Not allowed to revolt against me. What are you thinking? What are you thinking? I don't think you should do that. I don't think you should do that, man. I think you should just get the hell off my land. Oh, he's already uh, softening them, them up a bit for me. He's the most disgraceful king. Well, indeed. Angered. Um, but so can marry. Bozo needs. He, this guy has... Oh, no, he does not have a strong claim on anything. Okay, well then, I don't care. <laughs> I think we are, we, are, we, we asked this, uh, this guy. Bertrand Bozo needs, we asked. Because he had a weak claim. Okay, is it still your son? Yeah, Baderik 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 Great. And I hope we can kill this guy. That would be great. If we can sway Popo, then we have a, we have a good chance. So we're going to continue doing that. Oh, he's already at 100. He still says no, huh? His opinion of King Godzilla is a bit, a bit bad. Uh, actually, we might be able to... Instead of doing the spy network thing... We might be... Oh, vicious rumor spread. That's already fine. That's uh, that's already what we want. Um, does he have vicious rumors already? Because that's minus 10 opinion already, I, I think. So that's fine. Oh! King Diederik of Brittany inherited Kingdom of Brittany. Other titles from King Jakob of Brittany. Who was... Uh, what happened? He was killed in a chaotic battlefield duel. Okay. So my grandson is now my heir. 19-year-old King Diederik II of Brittany. Okay. That's uh, that's fine, I suppose. I, I think we raised him ourselves partially. Mm, mentor, yeah. So that's fine. Uh, young young kid on the throne, that's fine. We, uh, we could use some young blood in here. I think... Uh, uh, Diederik, when he, when he inherited the empire, was already quite old, I think. Or when he inherited the kingdom, I should say. Ah, Pepin is already here. <laughs> That's cool. Uh, kingdom of France. Yeah, we conquered as a claim. Oh, the Kingdom of Frisia, I should look at. Uh, this is not the Kingdom of Frisia, Jan. This one. Yeah, we inherited it in 1214, so that's 35 years ago, and then we were already, like, in our 30s. This guy is still 19. So we have some young blood. Some young, young, young bodies. Let the bodies hit the flow. Are we gonna... Yeah, I think... I think we're gonna still do this. Because it, it might not be the best choice, but I really want to upgrade the hospital fully. 5k... Uh, because I, I don't think we really need the troops. We have plenty of troops. Alright, yeah. We can uh, disband you guys. Do we have plenty of troops? It's actually not as much as I thought. I guess uh, we, we pissed off some vessels. Yeah, <laughs> quite a few of them actually. Tyrant, really, why? I think that's a while ago. So the Kingdom of France, envious, blah, 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 okay. Whatever. I think we're gonna need... Uh, quite soon we will need, I think 1250-ish or something, the plague starts appearing. It would be nice if we have uh, we have that, that hospital then. Uh, he's getting married. I won this uh, this war. We captured this guy. Where is he? Zentulo. Oh, he's terrible. Get out of here, man. <laughs> Such a casual murder, huh? <laughs> it's, uh, it's nice because we, we our first king we played was like a paragon of virtue. This guy not. <laughs> he doesn't care. 
אנו הוגוול ורך קאט חוואלאט. You're, uh, you can go, you're an old, an old woman, right? Our heirs are married, really? No, no. Oh, we are married. No, our heirs are married. Oh, he's betrothed. He's gonna marry this, uh, De Boulogne. The, uh, yeah, the, uh, the vessel of the Duke of Gelre, the, the sibling of the Duke of Gelre, that's fine. It's not the best, uh, best match in the world, but, hey. Oh, we can imprison him. Why? What are you doing? Kill Ramiro Map Ribald. Oh no, you can do that. <laughs> Go ahead. Even though he's a very handsome man. <laughs> you can kill him. I don't care. Oh yeah, we were killing this guy. How is that going along? Anything we can do? Yeah, we're swaying this guy, but he just still doesn't want to join. I think we might be screwed on this one. I think we might not be able to do it. But we will continue uh, antagonizing him. Maybe, uh, maybe we will. I get deceitful trade. Okay, good. More, uh, more, uh, more intrigue. You can use that. Except the suggestion that Maria and Contero get married. I don't care. I'm actually kind of surprised we're still alive. <laughs> I was not expecting us to live that long with uh, 3.5 health. But Cello the Purifier. Yeah, 90. 90 plot power. That, that, that actually comes quite close to uh, maybe having a successful plot. Out of uh, Duke of Champagne, you can uh, you can imprison. He's minus 56. Why is he? Why, why are they all so low? Tyrant, succession law. That's been a long uh, long time ago, guys. Should get over that. It's 20 uh, 20 could be a penalty. That's that's a big part of it. Oh hey, there we go. <laughs> the twilight years of his life. Uh, Count uh, Emperor Diederik becomes the Marcus of Hermetics. Very nice, very nice. Actually, now that we've become Magus, and this is the cage, and I have no trouble finding the right way to tell myself to Mayor Popo. I was not an envoy to his rum. Sure. Wonderful. He's still 100 with, yeah, the king. I don't know why exactly. But quietly encourage Helinda. Uh, thank God for Helinda's virtue. That's, that's no way to get ahead. Yeah, that's what I would say. He's betrothed to my grandson. <laughs> my granddaughter is betrothed to my grandson. Great. Fantastic. <laughs> niece, uh, niece and nephew, huh? Or cousin and cousin. Does this uh, re reduce uh, only time, right? Yeah. Now, uh, Meat Master Builder reduces costs as well, I think. That's an event that you can get. But uh, it's fine. No, actually, we can do that. It would be, it would be helpful. That's like 15%, so that's like immediately like 750 uh, ducats off. Yeah. That would be a big help. Uh, no need for any convoluted plot. Merely attacking King Godzello's the second character should be enough to make it clear how much I despise him. Let everyone in Frankie I know. Instruct all the town criers across your realm to mock and insult King Godzello on your behalf. Smirching his name and antagonizing him in the process. Yeah, sure. <laughs> King Godzello the purifier, screw you. Outstanding. He's angered. He hates me. Is this young uh, kid still? Uh, yeah, it's still his hair. Man, I really hope we can kill him. That would be fantastic. That would be like crowning achievement of my career. Well, not really. <laughs> we already conquered England. Uh, okay. Yep, you can have some more money. Sure, why not? That's fine. We like you, man. Although <laughs> you're a tribal kid slayer, but uh, version of Lithuania. Okay. The Catholicism is really doing well, huh? Eh? Lithuania is actually the strongest pagan kingdom that's still around, I think. Yeah, they're very strong. And they're Catholic now. Uh, where's this guy? We have uh, one county too many. Where's this guy that we invited that has a claim on the uh, the kingdom? This guy, this, this guy, right? Yeah, my creature. He's terrible, though. <laughs> can this be inherited? Will not be inherited unless pressed in war. Okay, well, you can have... The county of uh, Orleans, where is it? There you go. Hopefully we can press your claim, my good man. I would be very happy if we can do that. I think if if, if you if you fully antagonize him you get you get some chances to really like do uh, to really increase his opinion. Uh, you get uh, 
you get some some chances also even I think to kill him if you're good enough in intrigue. I don't know if we are. Ah, we're pretty good. Uh, oh, local build cost modifier. That's in Zeeland. Too bad. Weimar prospers. Kind of wanted it to be in Holland. Although maybe we already have it here. No. So that uh, the hospital would be a lot cheaper. He walks with the gods now. Uh, I hope his successor will be an, as enlightened as he was. Uh, looks like it. He's Catholic still. My buddy. My buddy, my boy. Yeah, he already loves me, right? Yeah, it's time to move elsewhere. Maybe we can do the number two on the list. It's only 12. Uh, or would he never do it? Yeah, more qualms. He would never do it. What about this guy? Yeah, I think he would do it if we if we uh, if we uh, commit. Oh, he's already already plus 100. This girl, 16. Did you uh, have any more crumbs? No. I think we might even just be able to do it like this. No. Okay, then it's only uh, only a little bit of uh, swaying, I think. Constanze Dandolo. Yeah, she's Venetian, right? Venetians love plotting. <laughs> uh, yep, yep, yeah, that's, they were one of the few medieval. Kingdoms were like their own, like Gestapo, their own like <laughs> military police. It's called uh, the Council of Council of Ten. They had like extensive uh, extensive powers uh, to to spy on their citizens. Not as much as the legend goes, but but still quite extensive, especially especially for a medieval uh, medieval place. That's what people always forget is um, is that the medieval times they had very harsh punishments, but that's like a symptom of being a very weak state because you you have to rely on scaring people off you will be enemies to the end yep <laughs> uh, you have to rely on scaring people off rather than actually being able to do anything solid about crime that's why harsh punishment is always like a sign of of of, uh, of, of a county losing control um f sister yep you can marry uh marry the king of norway why not go ahead go ahead Man, we're still alive, huh? 69 years old. That's great. That's great. Um, now we can do maybe a little, little holy warring. What is all uh, sunny around here? Is the... Uh, are they Catholic? No. Well, Densian. Hmm. That is helpful. Because we would really like Granada. Everyone move 15k, jeez. <laughs> a lot of uh, mercenaries, I guess. Ah, we can handle it. We can handle it against these filthy, filthy Moldensians. We can call in the Khan. Ah, we don't need him. The, uh, this war will be over before he's even here. Holland prosperous. Center of worship. Nah. Some of those are really good, but uh, not this one. Find the hermetic text. Um, no. Actually, I think now that we reached the top of the hermetic society and we, 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 we gained most of the, the benefits from it. Oh, actually, before we do that, we will write a magnum opus, I guess. Yeah, that's uh, that, that, that makes sense. Two hermetic acts we can also do. Scholar mystic, scholar theologian. No, no, we will keep, we will keep scholar. Yep, let's write the magnum opus. I want to write it on Intrigue, really. If you can do that. So I really want to <laughs> kill this guy. <laughs> Come on. 78%. 93 is Popo now. Still not want, want, you still not want, still not want to join me, eh? Man. Maybe later. I think at some point he will want to join me, and then we will be, I think we will be mostly golden. Uh, Markart, no, let's do the oh, we organizer guy. Oh, no, we made him our marshal. Mark, oh yeah, oh, yeah and Cherry uh, is dead. Yeah, okay, I remember we, we fought the Holy Roman Empire. And then he decided to suddenly die. <laughs> Man, Cherry, we liked you up until the end. <laughs> uh, for some time now, my wife, Princess Ines, has been avoiding me. She's not visited my bedchamber for several weeks. And I have demanded to know why she has given me nothing but feeble excuses. Today I overheard a couple of her servants gossiping. They said Ines has contracted syphilis. The poor thing. Oh. 
Nah. I will show that foul blasphemer what I do with traders. The traders. Yeah, I'm cruel still. <laughs> Humiliate. Declaim poetry. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> Venus is forced to spend the full hour listening to one of your guards reciting your most atrocious poetry. Not only is the brute butchering the rhythm of it, but you made certain this particular poem contains the most contrived metaphors. Your ears will ring with the contemptible cadence for weeks. <laughs> You're getting off easy there, girl. Unless you got the syphilis from me, that, that's very possible, I guess. <laughs> a best has passed. Or a family member of mine, no. King, married to King John of Scotland. Robin Hood and Little John sitting in the forest. Faithful prepares. Oh, finally we have another crusade. Finally, <laughs> it's been ages since we had uh, since we had one. My men are ready to Jerusalem. Oh, we're gonna we're gonna take on the Seljuks, huh? Okay. <laughs> uh, that's gonna be tricky, guys. Oh no, actually, he's not that strong. Hmm. Are men ready to Jerusalem? Yeah, no, we're uh, of course we're gonna do that. Even if we ourselves will probably not make it. Who's the beneficiary? Um, do we have any, uh, any good? Uh, it's all. We have so many family members. Do we have any decent ones? Blanche, Blanche, Blanche Floor, spy my master of Martin. She's pretty good. Giselle is also. Yeah, she's genius. Yep. Blanche floor, enjoy. You could also keep it, I guess. Nah. Nah, although we already own this part, we only own this part. I think it would make sense to... Uh, uh, why would I give my titles away? Yep. <laughs> I think I will uh, keep it myself. Because um, I think it makes sense. I think uh, it's much better protected if we have it. Because Celtics will not attack us so, uh, so soon. They will attack a uh, small little kingdom uh, very soon. Pope will not see it that way, but... You know. uh, theurgy, Astrology, Alchemy. Uh, alchemy, let's go for Alchemy. See if we can get that uh, plus one health one. That would be uh, very nice. Because uh, I don't think we're going to live long if we uh, don't get some health benefits. Uh, I think inviting Queen Constance 2050 we can do together would help us to grow closer, but I'm not entirely sure... What kind of activity I would suggest? Uh, gregarious. I shall invite her to a banquet. Yeah, she's gregarious, right? Man, why don't you die? Please die. Popo, why don't you want to join me? I think uh, we won't be able to do it before the crusade. One year, no. We should gather our, all our forces here because it's already on the way to the crusade, right? We will just raise our uh, our fleets later, and then we can just instantly move to the Holy Land. Is there any? Uh, maybe we can raise a Holy Order even. Yeah, we can do that. Knights Templar. Sure. The, uh, you can. You guys can move also to the south. We're actually even fighting heretics, so they. I think they would even help us in our battles. Okay, 71 people uh, attacked. Great. Give me that. Uh, level 6 and above. Okay. We can attack this army. We're already at 50%, right? So, probably they're pretty weak. Uh, Prince Mayor of Trace. No, no, you can. Uh, we don't want to. Uh, we don't want to, uh, to capture you or anything. There we go. 50% still. Oh, no, here's his army. Okay, maybe you guys can join me also. Uh, I fear my granddaughter Alinda is too cynical for rage. She's clear sighted. Ah, my uh, my cousin is a full on uh, member of the Hermetics. Best of luck in your studies, initiate. We uh, can uh, choose another apprentice. Our court physician, the Duke of uh, of Vergne, sure. He doesn't like us very much, but eh, we should get over it. We're not going anywhere. Universal panacea or transmutation. Universal Panacea, that's the uh, yeah, that's the one that that gives you health. So we're gonna try that one. So we could really use some health right about now. Actually, can we uh, gather ingredients? Actually, yeah, we can. Okay, we will find 
Uh, we go to the marketplace, I guess. Yeah. Oh, actually, we could have gone to the uh, hills uh, too, I guess. Because we both have a lot of learning. Okay, here we go. Big battle against the Genoese. There we go. Oh, are we losing? Seriously? Fuck, man. Um, I have decided that it might be profitable to take some time and resources to try to seriously hurt my sworn enemy. King Godzilla is an unbearable pestilence upon this world, and I will not rest until I have made his life a living hell. Plot power defense minus 10, general opinion minus 20. Or gains the trade's rest. Yeah, he won't die soon from uh, health problems, I think. So we could either go with uh, minus 20 opinion in hopes that that would bring in some guys to the plot. Or we could do the, the straight up 10% plot power, but I think we're going to do this one. Hopefully now... Ah yeah, see, we're being joined by the Queen now. But Popo still doesn't want to join, eh? Oh, maybe we can send him another gift. I think his gift expired. Still no. Man. Man, why not? Ah, sends me for a fight for glory. Okay, minus 12 we are. Now to convene with my agents, yep, definitely. <laughs> I still hope we will beat him. I don't feel so good. Oh shit. <laughs> I instructed the squire to weaken my opponent's armor, but I'm having trouble spotting the sabotage. Are you making a wish? King Godzilla asks impatiently. We have met this for hours and my scheming has led nowhere. I back away, clutching my face. It's going to leave more than a scar. Oh damn it. <laughs> well, I, I'm really gonna die any second now. <laughs> this is another minus two health, right? Yeah. I, I don't. I won't, I won't live long. Definitely won't live long. Ah, we won this battle uh, after all, because of the Holy Order. That's great. Okay, another battle. Hopefully this will end the war. And my life will be over soon. One chemical ingredient. Yeah, that's too little, man. I cannot even brew the, the thing. No, I need more ingredients. And we have vessels coming against us. Damn it. Ah. Okay, well, at least we got the... We conquered some, uh, some stuff from Genoa. We can uh, we can give that out before we die, <laughs> for our sudden and inevitable death. Um. Okay, what about you? Ah, you are you severely injured? No. <laughs> Welp. So much for our plans. <laughs> I mean, he kind of deserves it, right? <laughs> and for Diederik, he deserves this death. You know, he brought it on himself. <laughs> he antagonized this guy. Like for years, in order to get uh, to get him to uh, to confess, or to get him to uh, to lower his guard, and now uh, now it came around, it came back around. <laughs> it could maybe give it to like a strong claimant of uh, Kingdom of Castile, Kingdom of Leon. Does he own the Kingdom of Leon as well? Or do we need to conquer that, conquer him twice? Anyone with a strong claim on both? No, I guess not. Okay, well, uh, my man, why don't you come over here? We have uh, some nice counties for you. Ah, Universal Panacea, great. It is done, it is finished. After a year of sweat and toil, I have managed to produce a grand work on a chemical Universal Panacea while I'm literally dying in my bed. <laughs> this tome shall stand the test of ages, ensuring my knowledge and name shall conquer time itself. It will serve my success as well, and perhaps they will one day be able to add their own knowledge to mine. Perfect is the body that is free from disease and age. Okay, what is what does it do? It better give me like plus five health, or I will still not survive. Here we go, health plus zero point five. Nah, that's not bad. It's like five years extra life. <laughs> that's not enough to save me, I think. Oh, man, I can't believe we're still alive. <laughs> you suddenly see a shining white shape. It seems to be moving towards you. There's a strange sound in the air too, like a whispering. The version has appeared to me. I've been blessed. Yeah, no, I, I think, <laughs> I think you know, he's on his deathbed. He's gonna grab for anything, you know, to save him. So, <laughs> sure, why not? Why not grab the Lord? <laughs> ah, yep. Hello, my good man. Uh, can we? Ah, we can create the duchy. We have some. Uh, we have a nice present for you, my good man. It is called the Duchy of Ganara. There you go. We might even have a kingdom uh, title for you in the future. But, you know, 
we might not live that long. <laughs> 200 uh, gold still. Okay, why don't you come also over here indeed? We will... Uh, okay, our vessels start starting to hate us, but uh, soon there will be a crusade and then they, uh, they won't increase further. So hopefully that will be uh, all fine. And I'm guessing that is still the case that... Yep, oh no. I guess I, I, I thought that uh, it would still be the case that the English by themselves would have sufficient uh, fleets. Sufficient, uh, sufficient boats. But I guess not. Man, why am I still alive? <laughs> I'm not gonna live much longer, I don't think. I cannot imagine I will live... Uh, I will live very long. <laughs> But, you know, devil might have... Uh, <laughs> I'm actually surprised to live this long. Because <laughs> um, I've already lived since that severely injured. I've, I've still been alive. Maybe we can, we can even get our revenge on this guy. Before we die. Popo? Man, Popo. If, if only you would join us, man. We wouldn't be in this predicament. We wouldn't be in this predicament if you only would have joined us. Oh well. He died the way he lived. Oh look at our letters now. <laughs> our Seljuks are back. Ah damn it. They're beating us. <laughs> they have a bigger font size. One day we will conquer Spain. And then we will be even bigger. Okay, come on guys. When is the crusade starting? News from China. Son of Heaven has died and been succeeded by Zhao Chongzong. Like a predecessor, this new emperor is known to believe in an open China. All right. <laughs> we don't know anything about him, other than that he's the emperor of China. Ah, she became of legal age. That's my my ward, right? Oh, she's pretty good. She's pretty good. Welcome, welcome to my uh, my land. Hope you'll be able to rule in your own right. Man, I'm still alive. <laughs> County of Siva is converted to the Catholic faith. Maybe maybe it's a sign from God. You know? Because I'm, I'm fighting this crusade soon. I became zealous. Maybe God wants me to live to fight this crusade. Who knows? But is it a sign from God? Does God want Emperor Diederik to live to fight the crusade? This disfigured, severely depressed, severely injured man? Well, find out next episode. Thank you guys. Bye bye.